Oh my gosh, I can't believe I might be able to remake the Roman Empire as the Ottoman Empire. I am pumped. What's going on, everyone? It's me, your man, sponsored Alex the Rambler. Here we are, back again on the Great Wall Redux. I've been watching way too much, uh, rate my takeaway. Back on the road again. And today's video is indeed sponsored by Honey. More about them in just a moment. The Great Wall Redux has had a massive update in the past month or so. So I figured we jump on in and look at it's even got the 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 nation that we're going to play as here the ottomans uh there's been a major ottoman rework so we're going to jump on in as mehmed the fourth the puppet of enver pasha uh and have some rollicking good times or it might be an utter failure <laughs> so if you want to see more hearts of iron four please do comment like subscribe five thousand likes would be fantastic if we could get that. But I digress. We are currently in this situation. We have separatist sentiments. Oh, dearie me. We have uh, officers struggle. <laughs> and we have a sick man of Europe. Brilliant. But we could have Pan-Turkism. The Empire. Uh, uh, we could empower the Sultan. Or oh, we could have the Three Pashas. Who knows? Who knows what will happen? But we will select the Ottoman Empire. 1910. The powder keg of Europe. Bish bash bosh. Well, let's get this started. Now... The Great War Redux is actually one of my favourite mods. Uh, I, I, I just love it. I, I really like the changes that they've made from the original Great War. And their continuing development on the Great War mod. Really, pretty much, right? So, what is the uh, situation at the moment? It looks like Egypt is now a puppet oh, of the British. Uh, this is probably... We're probably going to lose this, aren't we? And we're just going to have to see how we get on. I have no idea how this is going to go. Oh my gosh, how large is this tree? It's pretty chunky. It's good. I love a chunky tree. Who doesn't, eh? Hey, eh? Sponsored video, Alex. Sponsored video. So these days, and especially over the past year and a half, uh, I know I've done a lot more of my shopping online. And that's where Honey comes in. It's a free online shopping tool that scours the internet for various promo codes and automatically adds them for you at checkout. So how does it work? Well, you get Honey on your computer for free with a couple of clicks. Then, when you're checking out on one of your favourite sites, Honey pops up and all you have to do is click apply coupons, wait a moment while Honey tests the codes and bish bash bosh, you might have saved yourselves a bucket of money. Alright, so I've only got like one pair of shorts in Canada. So let's say I want to buy a couple more shorts. Let's see how much money Honey can save me. Hey, I've just saved a $10. So you'll find the link in the description, which is joinhoney.com slash Alex the Rambler. Help me to help you to save some money with honey. Hey, has that been used before? It probably has, right? And thanks again, honey, for sponsoring today's video. Okay, let's do. Fearing a coup against his autocratic rule, the former Sultan left our army and navy intentionally weak. <gasps> we, must rehabilitate, rehabilitate, we must rehabilitate our military at once. Okay, I agree. Oh, at least we're not in a situation where we have absolutely zero factory. Uh. I mean, we might as well at this point, but we have three research slots, so I should probably get some support weapons and some trucks. And uh, I probably wanted to focus on my economy too, but you can't have everything, can you? Just how many uh, troops do we have? 620,000. Now, that's not a terrible size force. Just got to probably change around these templates quite a bit, you know? 29 combat width. Okay. I, I don't know the... I, I don't know if they've changed around the combat widths of what's meant to be good for this. Just FYI. I don't know. Do you know what, Albania? Do you know what? Have your independence. You're my puppet. And I may come for you once again. But I will allow... Hey. Hey, Greece. You don't get any ideas. I'll come for you too. All of these people wanting to escape from my rule. Oh, they don't know that I'll be back. Back again? Oh my gosh. Sorry. Sorry. Camel divisions. 10,000 likes and I'll do a camel only video. Hey, eh? Is that still a thing or is that like a 2018 meme? I've been playing Hearts of Iron for too long, Alex. Too long. Okay, let's do the legacy of the 31st of March. 1909, a reactionary coup attempt trying to reinstitute the absolutionist regime of the former Sultan was suppressed. <gasps> now, we all do know how I generally go in, 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 in these scenarios, don't we? <laughs> Begins with an M. <laughs> what the heck? 
What are you doing, Ferdinand? The Ottoman Empire will be known as Third Rome. What? Yes. Oh, there are so many branches. But no, I am going to go for the Roman Empire. All right, fork in the road. The dispute between the reactionary and reformist uh, officers have been going on for a long time. Right, well, that'll continue. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I might be able to remake the Roman Empire as the Ottoman Empire. I am pumped. Of course, it's all going to go terribly wrong, isn't it? Since when, when do things go right for me in, the, in these settings? <laughs> it's time to deliver the final blow to the Harbielli officer's clique. Do I want to do this? Uh-huh, uh-huh. I don't know what I'm doing, so I, I'm just going to go for this one. Okay, so I now have a reactionary coup. Uh, yep. So I'm now the Ottoman Junta. Okay, now we're going... Now we get in there. Sure, let's dissolve the Chamber of the Deputies. Just want the Roman Empire back. <laughs> and now time to purge the army. Good. War is coming with Italy. There must be purges for the new empire to rise. Army has been purged. We will now pacify the Villiers. Our rule should be imposed and secured. Extra stability, political power, increased compliance pretty much everywhere. Good. No resistance in occupied territories. Good. Good. Still have a lot of things to sort out. Oh, dear. Oh, my God. Yeah, I really did purge my entire military staff, didn't I? I have no... <laughs> I have... Oh, dear. Okay. Uh, what... Which one do I need? After the coup, organized by Yildiz Tezlakati, Sultan Mehmed V was overthrown as he obeyed to rivals of reactionaries from the Committee of the Union and Progress. And now there is the question of succession to the throne. Mahmed is required to officially confirm the name of the heir in order to... Am I saying that right? If I'm doing that... Or am I... Or do I... Or should I just say Mehmed? I apologise if me doing the... Is a... Is an outdated or offensive thing. I, 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 I'm saying it as I thought I would need to. But if it's just Mehmed rather than Mehmed, just don't cancel me for that. All right? We're going for Osman, though. And now we'll strengthen the autocracy. There he is! Look at that boy! Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Proclaim the succession of the Roman Empire. We'll be known as the Third Rome. Oh. <laughs> if I seem a bit odd in this video, I don't know what it is. I don't know why I'm so hype right now. Oh. No. Um... We will be defended. <laughs> so, uh, yes, my military is obviously not fully equipped. It's not ready to go. It's in a very dire state. So what we'll do is just fortify the f*** out of our coastline and just hope I can hold. That's what we're going to do. do, -do, 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 -do. Because I haven't had a chance to upgrade any of my divisions or produce anything of consequence. Uh, I'm going into this war without anything. But I know they want this territory, and I don't want to give them the territory, so uh, I will I will try. But I am now the third Rome. Take that, son of a gun! Ah! They, see? They did like a little attack here. They tried to invade Libya. Douches. I was prepared. Murder them all. Oh, where are they going now? Now they're trying to naval invade here! What the heck? Oh, this is great. This is really fun humiliating the Italians as the Ottomans. Well, no, no, I'm not the Ottoman Empire anymore. I'm Third Rome. Nova Roma? Hey! I bet all the Turkish viewers are hating me right now for creating the Third Rome. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, create a Roman unit. Yes. <laughs> we actually got it. We actually got some extra units. Oh, my gosh. What are the casualties for this? Wow. So, I don't know how this war ends. Uh, because I'm meant to lose, right? I meant to lose this. Ooh! Ouch. That, yeah, okay. I can only really go for one place at a time. Like, naval invasions I can defend all day long, it seems. So I have enough strength to be on a defensive war. I am not strong enough to be on an offensive war. And the Italians can't do nothing. The camels are winning! The camels are successfully defending the beachheads. There's freaking camel divisions! Oh, Italy. You incompetent soul. The Balkan League! Oh, I forgot about this. I don't need this. 
I don't need this right now. I'm doing a very good job against Italy. Just stop it. Stop it. I, I, I hate that navel sound. I saw one of Tommy K's clips where he said, like, that just haunts his dreams. And it, yes, it does to me too. Just, 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 please. Game. If I could disable that sound, I would, but then I wouldn't know if I'm being naval invaded. Okay, so the peace terms are literally, they, they get what they want. <laughs> Should have got my troops out first, eh? Do you know what? I think I'll reload that and get my troops out first. <laughs> oh, what a wally. I have no idea how I'm going to deal with this. Because I am rather lacking a lot of equipment. Oh, they're going to join the war as well, aren't they? Yeah, they're all in the pack together. Um... Ah! I am royally... <laughs> Screwed. Some of my troops are going to die, but that's okay. Because some of them will live. Ah, sh They took the port. They took Thessaloniki. Okay. This is uh, going to go horribly for me, I think. So all of these encircled troops are just going to die. Can't do anything about those. I mean, I guess I could have them. I chose not to. Do I give them peace terms? Sure. Look, I'm not in a position to be in a long, long war here. I will at some point, but for now, we're white piecing. But don't worry, I will be back. Yeah, we were taken advantage of. I lost a lot of division. Oh, did I lose almost half of my divisions? Oh no. But that's okay, because they were bad. Now I can get good divisions. I just needed time, really, and that's not something they give you. But then they're not happy with Bulgaria, right? So then they gang up on Bulgaria, and I can be like... <laughs> In theory. Search for investments, please. I need money. Oh, third Rome is like a shadow <laughs> of what I started as. Well, ah, good. It appears uh, Bulgaria <laughs> decided to... <laughs> oh, this would be amazing if I could just go after them right now. Romania declared war on the... Oh, wow. So, <laughs> Bulgaria is having a bit of a time. Oh, uh, Bulgaria is going to crumble before I even get a chance to do deal any damage to them. That's a shame. It's a real shame. Am I getting rid of my debuffs? No. 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 Okay. I'm in no state to go to war with anyone. Like, I am in a horrible position here. Uh, Germany and Austria-Hungary, I'm sorry, I won't be joining you. You're gonna have your own stuff to worry about. I need to cure the sick man, but it's gonna take me a while. Army modernization. Bam. <laughs> I t I t like, I'm just doing what I can, really, because this is just pretty... It's pretty dire. I'm still in a pretty dire state. But now I can default on debt, so we remove the public debt administration, which is... Not... It's not there! Okay. Ooh, fuel per oil. Increase that bad boy. Oh my god, I can cure the sick man. Oh, finally. So what does that get rid of? <laughs> yeah, we need to get rid of that. Oh, Franz Ferdinand! Sorry, I just saw the Franz Ferdinand has been assassinated. So, I mean, he looks happy about it. Mobilization across Europe. And uh, US declaration of neutrality. The Great War has erupted. Tuba, Milium, Spargen, Sonnum. To end all wars. Okay. Let the world burn. All I really care about is destroying Bulgaria. I'll threaten them. We'll get the event. Let's see if they want... See if they want some, shall we? I'll see if they want some. Uh, okay. Diplomats from the Sardamabov area have arrived today that they decline our offer to unite. Oh, really? Fine. I will try and destroy them. You could have just let this happen. But no, you have to be a... Ass. Alright, so I'm just trying to get some uh, army XP... Oh, no, never mind. They're... They're already beating... They're already beating me back? I'm already regretting. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh! Oh, you fool. You absolute feckin' moron. No, where are you going? Why are they going to Lund? I guess it will secure the flanks. Yeah, okay. So Bulgaria can start taking some casualties. Good, because clearly I... <laughs> clearly I wasn't equipped for this. I shouldn't have done this. Uh, 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 here's me thinking, oh, uh, uh, don't worry, mate. I, I, I'm, 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 I'm the new... I'm, I've got a new empire. It's the third round one. It's pretty big. It's pretty chunky. 
do you want to join me here? But, the, but I asked Bulgaria. Uh, no, no, why would we want to join you? Well, because I want to be strong and big. Well, no, we don't want you to be strong and big. Fine. Ah! I declared a jihad, but where did I declare it? What? No, I didn't mean to do a jihad. Oh, I clicked the wrong button. I very much doubt he's going to succeed at this naval invasion. But, you know, you might as well give it a try. Alright, so, uh, all of those troops just died. I naval invaded and just got absolutely wrecked. <laughs> what an absolute hash of this have I made. Oh my giddly goo. Alright, well now I need to survive until I actually get some decent combat divisions. I don't know when that's going to be, but clearly uh, I am not equipped for a war with anyone. I shouldn't have done this. This is a bad idea. They still don't have more divisions than me, but th their divisions certainly seem to operate better. Oh! I, okay, everywhere is going to be set to military industry. I, I'm just going to build military factories freaking everywhere. That's what I should have done earlier. Oh, I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a silly billy. Oh, I've researched close air support. Now you're going to get it. I'm out of manpower. Oh, this epidemic really is just... Ugh. Okay, I have cast now. I have cast. Now all I need are good freaking divisions and manpower. We need more men and supply. Okay, so uh, it's come to my attention that I'm... F so I will just hunker down here, hunker down in bigger, and uh, hopefully rebuild. Right, so they have me pinned down, but now I can finally rebuild. I can increase the amount of manpower. Bam. Oh, man, they're going to be in for it soon. Just give me another year <laughs> to actually get some equipment. I apologize to all of you that were expecting a show of competence when I created the third Rome. Clearly, I shouldn't have promised that because it's not going right very well, is it? The German Empire invokes... <laughs> we're better off without them. Sorry, Germany. I don't care how well you might be doing at the moment. I am in no position to join you. Bulgaria joined the Central Powers, though. Sure, yep, yeah, everyone can have access. Come on in, come on in. France wants me to join the Entente, fine. Third Rome shall join the Entente. Oh, Romania joined as well. Oh, no, nice. So did Serbia. You actually... <coughs> me. 1,000 defense? Modified to 340%. What the... Oh. <coughs> Another <coughs> epidemic. <coughs> I, I, can you tell I'm, sli I'm getting slightly irked? I don't understand it. The third Rome was meant to rise as a new empire, but oh, dearie me. Instead, I've had to. Oh, oh. Ah, that isn't even me doing it. All right, well, there's stats now. That's just insane. All right, how much damage is my cast doing? Oh, come on now. I overran them. Reclaim the territory for the glory. The glory of the third Rome. Oh, yeah, Bulgaria's getting. F oh, yeah. It does feel nice to stick it to the Bulgarians, though. Maybe the combat needs to be rebalanced, or maybe I'm just bad. Oh, good. Oh, come on! So you give me that, but you won't give... You'll give me Sophia, but you won't give me that. Do I... I, I think I prefer Sophia to Rahobodas. Thank you very much. About time I finally got a present. Gimme! Oh, Kaiser of all Romans. Yes, look at this. Division attack and division defense. Oh, I should have done that ages ago. <laughs> it's me, Hazard. Oh, I'm such a silly billy. Wow. Oh, wow. That could be pretty sweet if Romania manages to close this pocket. Return to Greece. Here we go. I think I've solved most of my problems. Yeah. My army now isn't atrocious. It's just not brilliant, which I'm okay with. I hope I get the chance to declare war on Greece. I really hope they give me the chance. Like, the Entente. I'm going in, baby. Yes. Take that, Greece. Of course Gre Greece joined the Central Powers. You fools! Oh, yeah, baby. Destroy them. Make them suffer. Oh, God, yeah. Finally, my howitzer divisions were actually doing a bit of damage until they just flop in like a bazillion units. Why do they get to flop? And I, and I just fall over. Okay, now we're actually dealing damage to their troops with our air support, with our cast. Oh, that is beautiful. Beautiful. 
Why? Why are they deserting? Why are they deserting? I have a hundred stability and a hundred war support. Why would you desert? Well, anyway, I've done an encirclement, so I can take Athens now. And on Twitch, I would have people screaming at me at the moment, saying, Fuel, Alex! Fuel! Fuel! Did you realise the fuel? Yes, I know about the fuel. Don't worry. I grow bigger. Uh, well, third Rome has got a bit bigger at least, so that's nice. Got that going for me. Now I'm uh, trying to go on a bit of an offensive with our limited size army. But I have uh, my howitzers all kind of complete now. And I'm about to get the modern howitzers as well, which will be very nice, I hope. Uh, but yeah, I'm just going to try and keep pushing for a little while. See what we can achieve with limited uh, limited attack objectives. For example, it would be nice to encircle the troops uh, in this area. And just kind of relieve a bit of, pre uh, of pressure from our um, incompetent allies. Yeah, my divisions are definitely better than the Austro-Hungarians. But uh, if we're to push them back entirely, it's going to take time. All it really takes is like one section to break through. And then you can kind of advance. My only problem is... Uh, well, uh, now I have an epidemic again. Uh, the the amount of attrition you take is horrid. Absolutely horrid. Because the AI hasn't built any infrastructure. So you're just overloading the supply. And you can't really achieve much because of the allies. There needs to be, I think, they should have, they should really put in a division limiter. Or rework the AI so, they, so it actually works. Because, I mean, I don't really know what I'm meant to do. When there's that much attrition, even though I could, in normal circumstances, push through there, it's just impossible with the attrition. So there's the, I'm not going to waste my troops. Uh, there's not really anywhere I could even naval invade. Maybe I could, like, naval invade up here in Wilmshaven. Uh, uh, screw it. Let's have a little jaunt in Germany. My divisions take so much supply. I think it's the heavy artillery. All right. Let's see if we can achieve anything against Germany before all of my troops perish. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> So we've got the port entirely surrounded. Bam. We have achieved something. Oh my god. And then they're just then they're just all rearranging themselves. Why not stop the position? Oh no. No! You're gonna overload the supply, you absolute pillocks. Ugh, pure pain. They seem absolutely determined to take back Wilmshaven. So I guess I'll just let them exhaust themselves. Uh, I, I don't know. The Germans have camels. Pourquoi? Oh gosh, could you imagine if they actually get pushed back? No, I shan't imagine it because it won't happen. We go. I will win World War One. See, you just right click and win. Are we winning? Oh, come on now. I despair. I actually despair. 29% attrition. You know, it's just the AI doesn't prioritize building infrastructure, so I can't do anything. The amount of divisions that they have is just bonkers. I can't order them to build infrastructure, so I'm stuck. And then every time I get a little bit, they just dogpile in more divisions. Because I can beat the German divisions, no problemo. Look, boing, boing, boing. But I need supply, which I cannot for the life of me seem to get because of my poxy ass allies <laughs> oh how did i lose that oh thank golly gosh everywhere everywhere has more troops than what their supply can handle when it gets to this point i just lose all enthusiasm for the scenario in which i'm doing because it's just like i know i can win i just it's impossible for me to get the supply i need red orange okay so i can't attack from any of these I could go down to Italy, but they're they're at pretty much capacity. Uh, up here, it's all red. I mean, maybe I can go around here, or do I naval invade more? I mean, I can naval invade all day long, but if I don't get supply, then what's the point? I mean, you, you can't even really get tanks, because you won't be able to uh, do anything with the supply. So it's kind of tricky to even think about getting advanced or even larger divisions than 20 combat width because the AI oh the AI just just end me now we've gained a little bit maybe we can push okay see now people could potentially come in because I'm taking all of these little forties okay so uh, I can hold up here all day long but I won't be able to do anything there because the allies 
in their infinite wisdom have completely oversupplied. Uh, <laughs> so I think like where I've completed most of the focus tree, uh, I am unfortunately not going to be able to capitulate Germany anytime soon. <laughs> I know that I'd win this, uh, given enough time now, because it, 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 it's just a grind. And the supply area, I mean, just look at that. And here, and here, oh, I've been over. The Allies! Oh! I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have joined a faction. Well, uh, this was my own doing. If you want me to continue this and make a part two of the grind fest, let me know. But I've, I've reached the point where I... I'm going to say goodbye for part one. If you do potentially want part two, let me know in the comments below. But I kind of feel like we've achieved an all right amount. Uh, would I have loved to have expanded Rome and, and taken all of this? Yes, absolutely. And taken Italy as well. Uh, but, but with the Allies oversupplying, like, just, 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 I, it's infuriating. But, really love the tree. It was a huge amount of fun being able to turn into the third Rome. Thanks again to Honey for sponsoring this video. If you want to download Honey for yourself, just click on joinhoney.com slash alextherambler. And I'll be back very soon. Toodaloo. Many thanks to Onion Duck, Maximilian Foreman, Wyatt Green, Kobe Dennis, Zachariah Mosby, Brandon Preston, Chancellor64, Jack Troku, Jiggly Crotch, Logan Whaley, Omjack, Tadhouse, Use Beef, Valhalla Halls, Vash, Warren P. George, and Yaboy yeah for being ridiculous Rambler supporters on Patreon, and many thanks to all the other patrons too!